What is going on guys and gals, Brooklyn Bound the Raid Scientist here, and today I'm going to explain how to do this singular orbit triumph in the Root of Nightmares raid. I'm going to explain how to do this triumph assuming you already know how to do the raid and its mechanics already. If you need a guide on how to do the raid, I'll have my full walkthrough linked down in the description. This video is just going to focus on how to do the triumph only. So, Singular Orbit is performed in the Macrocosm Encounter, aka the Planets Encounter of the Root of Nightmares. It states that a player cannot gain planetary insight twice in the same planetary shift. So, how do you do this? Well, recall that one full planetary shift includes both aligning all the dark planets on the right and all the light planets on the left, and locking in the correct light and dark plates in the middle for DPS, and then doing damage to the Explicator. Remember that the planetary insight is given to the players who get the killing blow on the terrestrial Lieutenant Colossus that spawn on the four triangular plates, and this buff allows you to see the real nature of all the planets. This is the buff you cannot get twice per DPS phase. The planetary shift buff, which actually lets you move the planets, you can get multiple times. So, in order to not get the planetary insight twice, you can only get the final blow on the terrestrial lieutenants once per damage cycle. So what do you do? Well, you'll have two players on the left and two players on the right responsible for moving planets as normal. When the Colossus spawn, assign only one player on each side, light and dark, to kill both Colossus on their side, and call out both planets that are out of order. This is very important. The two players who go first and kill the first set of Colossus have to call up both the planets on their side that are needing to be swapped, not just the one planet on their plate. Once they're called, then all floor players can do the swap as normal. Now, once all the light planets and dark planets are aligned correctly, you'll get another set of Colossus in order to see what the middle DPS plates are. This time, the other two players who didn't kill any Colossus on the first round will kill both Colossus on their sides and call out the middle plate's identities. Then, anyone can actually move and bring the correct planets to the middle plates to do damage and then DPS the boss. After DPS is over, the planetary shift resets and you can repeat the same process again with the same players. Remember that with Root of Nightmares, Bungie added a tooltip on screen if you mess this up. It will say, Encounter Triumph Failed, meaning someone accidentally got the Planetary Insight buff twice in the same phase. If this happens, you'll need to wipe and start again. Also, don't be afraid to use grenades and even some heavy to take down these Colossus if you're struggling, since you'll essentially be killing two by yourself. If you're having trouble doing this, other players can help you whittle them down a little bit. Be careful so that the assigned player is the one that actually gets the final blow. Also remember that if you aren't sure if you got the final blow on one, you can always have one of the two ad clearing players step in quickly to kill a set of Colossus as well. Either way, make sure you don't get the final blow on the Colossus twice in the same planetary shift, and you should have this triumph done in no time. Thanks for watching this video, and we'll see you next time.